Based on the conversation we had earlier, you had mentioned that some of your main concerns and your priorities for your window would be energy efficiency, then you said the appearance, durability, followed by ease, maintenance, and comfort. Is that correct? All right. Well, with those things in mind, I believe that the best fit for you would actually be the Simonton 6500. It's one of our premium um, vinyl windows here at Home Depot. It actually has one of the best energy ratings of any window in the industry. Um, has that great curb appeal that you're looking for, as well as that durability. So I pulled one of the samples out. I'd like to show you um, what it looks like. Actually, I'd like to do a little demo first to show you about the energy efficiency and why I believe the Simonton 6500 is the best fit. It's actually right over here, as you can see. It also has those nice colonial grills, those grids that you're looking for. Um, see that nice curb appeal and kind of a match your existing wood doors. Well, when it comes to energy efficiency, as I was mentioning, we got dual pane glass. So you got two glass, two pieces of glass here, and it's also double strength. So you see it's actually really strong. Not like your current single pane windows that you have right now. Uh, right here in this glass pack, it's about seven eighths gap, as I mentioned. We got um, these little chambers here as well. It's got 13 honeycomb chambers that actually give it more insulation in the frame itself as well. And I'm going to put that down for a bit. I think if you can hold on to that, feel how sturdy it is, take a look at it, get familiar with it, let me know if you have any questions about that later. Uh, what I'd like to do is show you um, an energy efficiency test here. So what I have here is a heat lamp. Hope I don't blind you with that. And over here, I've got this little radiometer. You see that little wheel in there? There's gas in there, and what happens is with the heat, that little wheel starts spinning. See how it's spinning? Anyhow, this little, this little wheel here represents your electric meter. And what happens, right, is you try to heat the inside of the house, and you got the hot air coming in, fighting against your air conditioner, and vice versa. You got the cold air on the outside coming in when you're trying to heat your house. Uh, in the winter. So let me show you here what we have. Um, give me a second. I stepped away from my sample. Anyway, well, let me improvise real quick. So right here we have is a single pane glass. Single pane is what you have right now in your current window. And when you put that, if I put that in front of here, and you look at that little meter, it's still spinning, huh? It hasn't slowed down one bit. Actually, you can put your hand right in front of here. Don't put it too close because it might get a little too hot. But you can feel that heat, right? Yeah, it gets pretty warm. I actually have this little uh, heat gun here. I can sense about 182, 189. Yeah, it's getting close to about 200 degrees. So that, that puppy's getting pretty hot. Now let me show you um, what happens now. So with technology, Obviously, you know, windows have improved. The single pane kept out, you know, some of the elements, you know, the wind, the rain, uh, possibly, but not too much of the UV rays, but it kept out some of those as well. So let me put up what's next would be actually a double strength glass, which is like one of the panes of what's in here in the, in the Simonton 6500. That was actually the next technology introduced to the window industry. So I put one of those in front of here. You see that uh, radiometer still spinning. Um, it might have slowed down a tiny bit, but I don't think really, I doubt it slowed down much at all. It's still moving pretty fast, as you can tell. Well, shortly after that, the double strength, actually they introduced um, the dual pane window, which is actually what's in here, but it's a little bit different. I'll explain to you why in a few minutes. So if I put a double pane glass in there, it's got two pieces of glass. And let's see what happens. You can actually feel... Put your hand in front, you still feel a little bit of heat. See, it's still pretty warm. Uh, you know, it's slowed down a bit, so it's still moving, but not quite as fast as it was before, but it has slowed down a little bit. So that was pretty good. That was a good attempt at, uh, at energy efficiency. You know, cut down on the noise a little bit by having two pieces of glass and, you know, a couple other benefits uh, from the double strength and single strength that you don't get with those. Well, now what's missing in here? Now, humor me for a second. Now, what if I put a piece of glass up here and you see this stuff in the middle? You know, it's kind of familiar. I think what's in your walls, right? That insulation. 
Well, that seemed to do the job, right? Look, the meter's slowing down. It's almost come to a stop now. So what's the problem with that, Mr. Jones? You're right. You can't see through it. And that's the problem that they haven't been able to solve until now. And this is why the Symington 6500 is actually the best choice for you when it comes to energy efficiency. Let me explain. Let me put it in front of here first so you kind of see what happens. Actually, feel free to put your hand in front here. It's actually a lot cooler to the touch, huh? It's not, it's not hot at all. And I do that, that meter, that radiometer that represents your meter, it's pretty much come to a dead stop. Now that shows the proof is in the pudding, correct? Well, let me explain to you some of the reasons why and how that works. Let me turn off the seat lamp, put it away so that I, no one gets hurt. So your Simonton 6500 has got not only dual pane glass, but it's got a coating called low E, which stands for low emissivity. What that does, it keeps the heat from coming in by deflecting it away while still letting the sunlight in. So you still see right through it, as you can tell. It keeps, it reflects the heat back away from the house. It has films actually put on the outside pane, right here on the sash, the outside piece of glass. It's sprayed on, I believe, it's actually what they call a um, silver oxide. So it's kind of like the same thing they use to make a mirror. But it's just a very light coat. If you were to put coat over coat over coat over coat of that, then you would actually create a mirror effect, right? And then you wouldn't be able to see through it again, right? So that's one of the things that, that's done to help your energy efficiency, which is why that heat was not penetrating through. It was actually deflecting the heat away from the window. Uh, another thing... That they've done is actually, or another thing that that actually does, the coating does, it blocks up to 84% of the UV rays. So when you have a window that's close to like to a dining room table, a sofa, or a carpet, you know, you don't want to fade, uh, it's going to protect that from fading as well. So it's great value for, uh, for what you're getting in this window. Uh, another thing that Simonton's done is inside these two panes of glass, they put a gas in there. It's called argon gas which works a lot like that insulation I showed you earlier. Other than that, it's completely transparent. The gas is actually six times denser than air. So that actually cuts back on the noise tremendously, as well as it insulates the window from any of that extra heat coming through or the cold coming through, anything, any of the elements from outdoors. Uh, that right there is a great benefit. But that's not all. You mentioned durability, right? You can see how sturdy this window is. Uh, you can see here on the corners, this has got a four-point fusion welded uh, corner. It's almost seamless. It's giving it a nice, smooth finish. Uh, another thing this, that they have here is they've got this consistent rail, it's an extruded rail um, on the sash to where if it's a slider, it'll slide very easy from left to right. It'll also, um, on your double hung and single hung windows, you can pick it up really easy, slide it up, slide it down. Um, which leads me also to explain that uh, with this double hung window you have here, it's got a counterbalance. The, the coil spring is not the weighted springs like what you had before. And I'll show you a little sample of that later. It's in my bag. I'll pull it out for you so you can actually take a look at what the spring is, is like. Um, as you can see right here, it's got dual cam locks. So when you got the meeting rail, right, you got the meeting rail right here in the middle, and when it meets with the other sash, you get a very tight seal. Not only does that pull the two sashes together, but if you look at the weather stripping on this side and this H channel, first off, you see how it's got a little U, little H, uh, little U shaped channel. Sorry, right there, it's actually got one of those on the stationary panel and the interlock. They kind of cut together to create an even better seal. As you can see also, it's got weather stripping. It's got these two coats. It's got this, this bubble weather stripping, this other flange right here. So it seals real nicely to the opening. And it's also got it right here all the way along the framing. It's got nice weather stripping. So it's sealed all the way around, which what that means to you, Mr. Jones, is that cool, that whistling wind that you had in your, in your bedroom from those wood windows, you're not gonna have that any longer. It's gonna be airtight. And that's what you want. That's what keeps the cool air in, the hot air out. On top of that, we've got the, the nice um, the chamber, the honeycomb chambers and the frame. 
that causes insulation. You got the two panes of glass. You got the argon gas. You got the um, low E uh, coating. All those things help this become a very efficient window for you. Uh, another thing is that you'd mentioned, um, what I'd like to mention is actually that this window is made out of 100% pure virgin vinyl. What that means, it's not going to crack, it's not going to peel, it's not going to blister. You don't have to worry about getting the window painted shut like your old wood windows. So you're going to have years and years of opening and closing without having a hitch. And if you do have a hitch, I'll tell you the good part about that. Next, these windows actually come with a double lifetime warranty. What that means is that the warranty is actually transferable. If you ever sell the house or, you know, the house gets willed over to a family member, whatever may happen there, it, the, the warranty gets, gets passed on. Now with the double lifetime warranty, also what that includes is any glass breakage. Let's say your neighbor hits a baseball and it goes through this glass. Well, you just call Home Depot. We'll come out, we'll replace the whole piece of glass for you. Because remember, it's got that argon gas, right? So if you had a hole in the glass, the gas would escape. You wouldn't have to worry about it. It's odorless, it's harmless, it's non-toxic, but you would have a broken glass and you wouldn't have the insulation anymore. So what Home Depot would do is come out, replace that whole sash for you, as well as the window screen. If you ever have a rip, if it, if it fades, uh, if your cat decides to chase the a little mouse outside and runs through the glass, well, it runs through the glass, sorry, runs through the screen, the screen will get replaced. No extra cost, that's included in the double lifetime warranty. There's just so many great benefits to this window, folks. 